is one area where actually uh, I'm very surprised at our performance. Mm -hmm. You see, our target was to digitalize 5,000 uh, government services as at 30th June, mm -hmm. yeah, 2023. When the president went to officially launch the digitalized services at that date, we had surpassed that target by, by 84. We were at 5,084 services fully digitalized while a number of services were partially digitalized. As we speak, wherein we have a critical mass of, of 7,543 government services fully digitalized. Mm -hmm. We envisage that by the end of the year, out of a possible 10,000 plus services that can possibly be digitalized, we shall have digitalized all these services. So we will be running a paperless government. We will not be having uh, members of the public visiting government services to do what? To consume government services. What we are saying is that if we have got critical ICT infrastructure in place, then we digitalize the services. All that remains is for us as government to ensure that members of the public can now consume these government services from the comfort of wherever they are. And to facilitate this, there are two critical things that we have also done. One, we have embarked on a massive digital skilling program. Yeah? Targeting the youth and members of the public. As we speak, we have managed to train 350,000 Kenyans. On the flip side of it, more so through our recently launched Jitume program, which we have been rolling out through the Tivet in partnership with the Tivet institutions, we have managed to create jobs for the youth. So our objective in that space is not just digital skilling. We are also ensuring that once we train the youth, we are simultaneously reaching out to global technological companies to get digital jobs for our youth. Because the white collar jobs that we have been used to traditionally over the years the numbers have now drastically either diminished or they are non-existent. So the only option available for government is to get digital jobs for our youth. And that is the frontier that we are pursuing with zeal. As we speak, we have managed to create over the last one year a total of 109,000 digital jobs for our youth. And we believe that in this space, we should be able to create or attain a threshold of 1 million jobs for our youth. And that will be a major, major, major game changer because we are not just creating these digital jobs in the digital space. We are creating these jobs right there in the village. 